Alright guys, well this is it. Uh, as you can tell by the title, uh, it is time for me to go to Hawaii. So, um, as a lot of you know, or a few of you know, I, don't, I know I don't have a lot of followers, but um, I was furloughed from my job. Uh, I worked at an electric car startup and uh, they had investor issues and whatnot, and anyway, the majority of the company ended up getting furloughed. Um, <clears throat> I was furloughed since November 1st. I did a <laughs> trying to sell some stuff, uh, preparing for the move. Anyway, um, I did uh, a short stint back at SpaceX, which was my old company. It was a contract. Uh, I was supposed to last three months. It ended up lasting about half that. Um, I've been driving Uber the last month and a half or so just trying to cover my bills and whatnot. Um, and my wife and I were talking about it this past week and we made the decision that I am going to move to Hawaii. So next month, which is April, uh, today is March 14th, 13th. Yeah, March 14th. Um, so today's March 14th. Um, we're basically giving notice on our, our place where we're staying now, uh, tomorrow. So we will need to be out of here by the 15th of April. Um, my wife is actually going to be staying here for about six months or so, maybe as long as a year. It just, I guess it depends on how long it takes me to start getting things set up. Um, so she's going to be moving in with a family friend, uh, and going to be getting a shipping container delivered to the house, going to be loading up everything that we want to take to Hawaii, going to be selling a lot of our stuff, um, like really downsizing. We're currently in a, a three bedroom um, duplex right now. So um, yeah, we have a lot of stuff that we're going to need to get rid of and ship. So basically that's what's happening. Um, I got a call this week from my job. Uh, that I was furloughed from telling me that I'm terminated. So after four and a half months of being on furlough waiting to be recalled, um, they have no idea when they're going to start recalling people. So now rather than keeping them furloughed, they're uh, just terminating our positions, I guess. So kind of bad news, but um, you know, good news because I'm going to do what I want to do and get started on our land in Hawaii. So um, I guess this is something that I talked about in the past on Instagram and on YouTube here. Um, my, my big picture goals were always going to Hawaii, developing the land, building a house, building a shop, you know, building some cabins for Airbnb, um, starting a coffee orchard, um, had a lot of plans. All this was set um, initially we were or originally we were planning to move to Hawaii next year which would have been um, towards the end of summer of 2020 is when we were originally planning. Um, so that's basically just getting bumped up now. So um, I will not be doing any blacksmithing. Uh, I'm not going to have the capability of it. I will be packing up my shop here and everything's going to go into the container, go to Hawaii. I will, as soon as I'm able to, I want to build some kind of a small shop, you know, on our land. I mean, it doesn't have to be really big um, that I could do some blacksmithing on. I'm not going to have capability to use my grinder or any power tools, anything like that, right away, uh, unless I get it like a generator or something, which I may end up doing. Um, so this is, like I said, what I was talking about in the past where my uh, channel and my Instagram is kind of going to shift directions. Um, blacksmithing was always going to be a part of it. Um, it was always part of my big plan. Um, but it wasn't my initial focus when I started, you know, my Instagram and my, I guess, my company. I don't know if I'm a company yet or not. A brand. Um, I don't think I'm a brand yet, but... Um, <laughs> the Hawaiian Viking 
eventually will be kind of a brand. You know, once I do have coffee, I start selling that and other products and blacksmithing stuff. And, um, you know, once we get the Airbnb stuff going, so, uh, that's it. So kind of exciting news. Um, I know this is going to be a fairly quick video, but I just wanted to let everyone know that I am going to be moving to the island. So, uh, this is most likely going to happen. I mean, I'm still trying to coordinate the shipping container, shipping my vehicle, um, you know, getting moved out of this place and getting my wife situated. But realistically, it's probably going to be the end of April when I'll be actually on the, on Big Island. Um, I'm still trying to coordinate and find a place for me to stay for at least two or three months and uh, until I can kind of get something happening on our land. I got a clear you know that's going to be a whole thing and then that'll be a whole nother video where I'm going to um, kind of outline my plan for the land uh, the stages of development that I'm going to go through um, but the important things right away is I'm going to need to clear land for the coffee orchard because that's was kind of one of the big parts of my plan and the coffee takes uh, the trees take a couple years to actually grow to where they start producing and it'll be about five years before they're fully matured and, and fully producing. Um, so I want to get that going as soon as possible. So that's going to be one of the main focuses once I get there. Um, also I plan to um, initially for living I'm going to be buying a shipping container and I'm going to be turning that shipping container into a tiny home. Uh, yeah okay <laughs> offer up um, so I'm going to be buying a shipping container putting that on the land turning it into a tiny home and that ultimately will become one of our Airbnb cabins that we will rent out uh, but that's going to be it so uh, I appreciate everyone that's been watching me so far on this journey I hope that you stick around um, I will be doing blacksmithing in the future I'm just not sure how long it's going to be. It could be a few months, could be six months, I don't know. Um, but I will be documenting everything that I do in Hawaii. You know, all the building that I'm doing, set up, it's going to be everything. So um, we're going to be having solar system. Uh, we're going to be having water catchment. We're going to have to do, you know, septic tanks and all the plumbing and everything, electrical stuff that's going to happen in the house, in the cabins, um, you know going to be getting uh, livestock. I know immediately probably be getting chickens and uh, sheep because the sheep I will be using to maintain the coffee orchard because they will be my lawn mowers. Um, but yeah, so making big moves and uh, ready to say goodbye to California and hello to Hawaii. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe. If you're new to this channel, there's going to be a lot more stuff coming up about off-grid living and building and everything that comes with that. So thank you again and uh, I will see you guys soon. Bye.